Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of BS for Build. In today's episode, we are gonna mount the whole front end. We're gonna properly build mounts for the front bumper, the fender, the hood, and the headlights. Because once we have all that stuff mounted in there, then we know how much space we have for things like the heat exchangers and the radiators and all that other good stuff. So just like we built mounts and secured our quarter panels in the proper spot permanently, we're gonna do the same for the whole front end. Stay tuned. Before we get down to work, I wanna take a second out to thank our sponsor. Today's episode is sponsored by Metal Supermarkets. Metal Supermarkets is where I got all the metal behind us here. It's where we got all the metal that you'll see us working with today. It's actually where we've sourced all our metal for the show for the last however many years since we got started working. Metal Supermarkets is known as the convenience store for metal. It's a one-stop shop. They have tons of stuff on the shelf ready for you to have access to immediately. They also have a very wide variety of different types of metals all under one roof. So they're gonna have what you need. You don't have to go searching around from one store to the next to the next to get all the metal for your project. They have no minimum order quantities and they can cut to size. You don't have to buy any metal that you don't need. And I can tell you firsthand, they have great customer service. I always enjoy working with the people down there to get the metal that we need for our project. Even when I walk in there kind of like scratching my head saying I'm not exactly sure what I need, they can help point me in the right direction to get what we need that will suit the stuff that we're doing. Overall guys, the service is really great. They process the orders really fast and they always have what I need. So I highly, highly recommend Metal Supermarkets. So for your next metal project guys, check out the link in the description below to find a Metal Supermarkets near you or to uh, contact them and get a quote started for your next order. So huge thanks to Metal Supermarkets for sponsoring this episode. Let's get down to work. Oscar's gonna be running the show on this one. I'm just gonna be doing the narrating because I'm uh, secretly back there working on the wide body kit, scheduled to be done uh, the day before SEMA. So um, I'm gonna let him just do, do this whole thing on his own. He's got free reign. And uh, we were just talking, and one of the first things that we're probably gonna wanna do is mount the front bumper on here, figure out the height that we wanna have that, and build a nice structure that is nice and strong down here that'll hold the front bumper, but also be able to bolt our lip into it as well so we can have a really nice and sturdy front lip. got everything all measured out everything's all kind of like test fit and he's got a game plan um, so what he's going to be doing right now is cutting this front support down here and that's the that's the support that's going to go on the lower lip of the front bumper also our actual lip that goes through there that'll be a support for that so he's going to cut that out tie that into there and then start cutting the pieces that are going to come out on the sides Oscar got everything all cut up real nice. We got perfect angles and it's making a shape. You guys have seen it like already when he's laying it out, kind of like that, like that, and like that. So he's gonna go ahead and TIG weld it all up now so he can start getting it in line and uh, start working on the side pieces.
update for you guys while we have the bumper on. So Oscar's welded up this piece, you can see as it goes through there, and then starts heading straight towards the front. It comes out on each side the same. And then now we're looking at the straight piece that comes across here that we will eventually be mounting things like the, um, all the cooling systems, so like a radiator, the heat exchanger, all that stuff. This will be like a main brace that comes across and will connect into that. And then that also we can build a support that comes off of there to hit these Zeus tabs in the front that hold the bumper onto the car. So there's a couple mounting points where we hold the bumper onto the car. There's here, here, one in the front, and then some on the lower. So we're trying to make sure that we have nice structure in there. So Oscar's working on these side pieces. He's gonna get those cut and welded in. battery died. So Oscar just finished welding out kind of our, our base structure. So this is again like what uh, part of our aero stuff, like our lip is going to bolt to, um, our bumper on the sides, and uh, and the bumper in other places as well. It's going to bolt to that, like on the bottom. So the next thing is is uh, on stock Lamborghini, there's a bar that runs right from here and it runs up to here, and you can see where they kind of cut it out. So Oscar's going to go ahead and channel out one side of that bar so it fits in there really nicely and runs diagonally right to this point right here, and this. Uh, uh, is a mounting point right here mounts up to the headlight but then also that bar runs pretty much parallel with the fender and allows us to be able to mount onto the fender using tabs not straight into the bar but you get the idea if i say bar very many more times we're just gonna have to take a detour from this episode <laughs> Oscar just wrapped up our uh, our diagonals that come from kind of the cowl area down to the front impact bar. So this is, like I said earlier, fenders, headlight mounting points and stuff like that. Looks fantastic. So you can kind of see everything's tacked in and then Oscar's gonna go through and fully weld everything out uh, once we get everything set. So the next step is Oscar's gonna start building the mounts for the headlights. We're gonna get the headlights mounted with the bumper kind of and get everything situated. And we'll try and mount the headlights and the bumper into this frame. Oscar had to go a little bit of a different direction to be able to mount the headlights properly. He needed to make sure that the bumper was mounted properly. So that's what you just saw him do. He's got his brace coming off of here and then our, our big old mounting plate right here with the Zeus tabs going into that. And we got one there 
and obviously one over there. So now Oscar's grabbing out our headlights to do the test fitting. Now these headlights came from the guys at Mullins. Huge thanks to them. They gave us a great deal on these headlights. Uh, Mullins is a great resource for used parts, guys. So I'm gonna put a link in the description. These were the guys that we went and visited in St. Louis. He actually showed us these lights in St. Louis and just shipped them out to us. We got a huge, huge discount because they got a couple broken tabs. Totally beast for build style. We'll rebuild the tabs and we're good to go. So Oscar's now gonna go ahead and you know test fit those in there and find a magical way to mount them properly. Good luck, Oscar. Oscar just wrapped up tack welding in these really, really awesome headlight mounts. Uh, so you can see he built a really cool triangle and then like bent this tab and then we used the dimple die and punched a nice little dimple die in there for extra strength. They're perfectly level with the car and everything. It's it's basically magic. It looks awesome. I really like the, the aggressive look that it adds to. Let's get a headlight in there so we can show them where it, how it sits. So these headlights are really, really massive and uh, weigh a lot. So it's it's pretty tricky mounting these things. So one mount goes on the bar here that we've added in. This is like the top of our impact bar. And then um, the other mount is going right here. So that's why that kind of thing goes out like that. And then we're working, they're uh, gonna go ahead and build the third mount right now. Oscar and Kyle just got the headlights mounted up. So uh, our headlights, we, we bought these with some broken tabs. We knew that going into it. So we got a little bit creative. This one's got two good tabs. So we got two solid mounts and then we did a side mount through some of just the meat of the, the headlight where that's where the other tab goes. Um, and then this one's got one and a half that I'm gonna have to plastic weld on. And then again, we did it through the meat of the, of the light right there. So it's looking really good. It's nice and firmly mounted. So the next step is um, Oscar's gonna go ahead and right off the front here, there are uh, where these Zeus tabs go is where the bumper um, needs to mount up to the front of this. And that has a lot to do with the kind of the body line that matches up with the light. So he's gonna go ahead and build those mounts right now. And then uh, we should be able to test fit it all. We've been test fitting it the whole time, as you've seen on the camera, but we should be able to throw it all together and everything will like line up perfect, which will be really cool to see.
right, so Oscar just wrapped up uh, modifying the, the headlight mount. So what we decided to do is we kind of broke the tacks off and the headlights on the back needed to go down more to get a cleaner uh, edge around here. So we went on top and then on top as well. And it worked out really, really well, uh, as well as he obviously built in these uh, front pieces here that hold the bumper. So now the bumper is like fully, fully on the car. Um, headlights are mounted into the car as well. Everything needs to be fully welded out still, but it's looking really, really good. So now we're gonna go ahead and wire a bunch of stuff up and wire in the headlights and see what happens. We got the headlights powered up. So we uh, we didn't, our, our center console, you guys remember, is like under construction. So we, didn't, we don't have the switch to turn the hazards off. This car, when it turns right on, thinks it's been in an accident still. So that's something we gotta work on. So you're gonna see the, the hazards blinking, but these headlights are beautiful. They work fantastically. They're shooting a good, good line across the, uh, across the shop here, man. This is awesome. This looks so cool. I'm so stoked on this. Looks phenomenal. Oscar did a great job of getting really good body lines around everything. And this is a really, really sturdily built setup for us. It's fantastic. All right, guys, that is a wrap. Oscar did a phenomenal job working on that while we were off dorking around on wide body stuff, which I'll tell you part two is going really good. So I'm really, really excited about that. I hope you guys tune in for that. Uh, that'll be coming up really shortly. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the show, you want to help out and support these builds, head over to bsforbuild.com. You'll find our merch there. And just thank you guys all so much for watching and supporting and watching the videos all the way through, man. It really helps. And I'll see you guys very soon. Peace! <laughs>